Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to the last week of school. Um, this is your second last day of math for fifth grade school year before you guys officially move up uh, to the middle school. Um, so do all your routine stuff. <laughs> Obviously, Colton's here. He wanted to say hi. You want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> so do all your routine stuff. Um, little twist on the number talk today. So it's another one of the which one doesn't belong that I know you guys like a lot. But I've changed it to where there's one missing out of the four in the sets that you guys always see. So I want you to do it one of two ways. I want you to come up with a fourth number that would fill in that set that doesn't have anything to do with the other three. So like the other three have something in common and then the one that you decide doesn't. Or you could put one in that belongs with two of the three that are always already there. And then one of the three that's already there doesn't belong with the four now that you've created by adding that last one. So if you want to do one of those ways or both of those ways or multiple more ways, you know, with some of those, uh, whatever you want to do, but have fun with that. I'm interested to see what you guys come up with. Uh, the lesson focus today is an old MPS problem that focuses on fractions of a whole. So you'll see a picture. Don't forget the picture represents a whole. It's broken into all these different parts, different shapes. You need to first figure out what fraction is each part of the whole, not of its own special part that some of you are going to go like focus on. Make sure each fraction is of the entire picture that you see. Okay. It has to equal one whole. Then there's two questions to answer for me after that. The second question of the two that you're sending over to me make sure you understand that it's asking about, about. So there's not a perfect answer here. It's just an about question, like an about answer. Okay, so kind of use your estimated skills there. Uh, you have one more chance for Math Olympiad. If you're doing some of the optional, I know a lot of you take me up on that and uh, take Dr. Gordon up on that, the uh, optional Math Olympiad problems every Tuesday. This is the last one of your life that you'll ever have a chance to do because they don't do them at the middle school. They don't do them at the high school. So this would be the last math Olympiad problem you could ever try. So give it a shot. Okay? Um, it's not required, just optional. But if you have some time, you want to challenge, go ahead and do it. Uh, last thing, just to remind you, is tomorrow, uh, Wednesday, at 11 o'clock, is the Wonder of Wonders program, the WOW program from Carnegie Science Center. Uh, we've already been talking to your parents about it. Uh, if you are going to participate in that, it must be at 11 o'clock tomorrow. You have no other time to do it or see it. You have to be online at 11 o'clock. Uh, we're sending the link to your parents' email. Uh, your parents have to be the one to open it up and then to give you access and permission to be on there. So that's why it's going to them. Okay. But 11 o'clock or else you don't get to participate in it. Okay. Um, all right, I think that's it. Um, let me know if you have any questions today. Colt and I will let you get started. Colt, you want to say bye and have a good day? Bye. Have a good day. All right, everybody. Talk to you later. Enjoy your last week of school. Bye-bye.